How's it going guys? JT Judgment here and welcome to another player review, or I should say legend review, uh, here on my channel. As you can see on the screen and by the name of this video, we're going to be looking at Patrick Clivert today. Now, let's have a look at his card face stats. He has got 86 pace, 82 dribbling, 84 uh, shooting, 87 heading, 79 passing and 55 defending. So those are very, very, very good card face stats if you ask me. Uh, let's have a look at his in-game stats as well as always i will highlight a few of his best ones he has 87 ball control 91 finishing 89 head accuracy 88 on the long passing 84 long shots 93 on the shot power his skill attributes are very very impressive uh, some of his physical attributes he has 87 on both acceleration and sprint speed uh, 91 jumping 94 reactions uh, and that 82 strength obviously strength being one of the uh, bigger parts in ultimate team this year so having 80 two on the strength stat uh, should be uh, should make you think that he will be very reliable in shrugging people off the ball does he do that in game though well let me get, let me uh, explain and show you guys exactly what I thought now going from the uh, the, the, the goals that I scored uh, uh, in this video that I show you you will think that he is a very very good player and I've got to, I've got to tell you guys he is one of the best players in Ultimate Team in my opinion, he is definitely one of the best players that I have used, I have I had so much fun using this guy, now let's go through uh, his positives one by one first off being his pace, 86 pace on the card I've got to agree with that, he felt very very fast his shooting, 84 shooting on the card, I've got to disagree with. Now, before you start huffing and puffing, <laughs> I've got to say I disagree in a good way. I honestly felt his shooting was too good to be given an 84 rating. Um, his long-range shooting was absolutely fantastic, as well as his short-range shooting. When it came to finishing, in and outside of the box, I had no problems. Uh, his weak foot, as well, I've got to agree, is is he honestly felt like a five-star weak foot. Is is five star? Is I should, he's got four star weak foot, uh, but it felt like five star. His left foot was honestly just as reliable as his right foot. I had no problems using both feet with this guy. Uh, he's got four star skills, obviously, so people that like to use skills will like using him. Um, and just all around, when it comes to his shooting, it honestly felt as though his shooting was as good as Ronaldo's. And if you know me. You know that I think that Ronaldo has got the best shooting in the game. And for me to say that somebody's shooting is as good as him, they've got to be good. <laughs> and Clivert is definitely absolutely fantastic. Now, uh, when it came to his heading, 87 heading on the card, I've got to agree with that stat again, guys. Now, I understand that heading this year in Ultimate Team is extremely overpowered, uh, but I did score quite a few header goals with him. Not that many, if any, is going to be included in this video, D simply due to the fact that Clivert scored so many fantastic goals for me. I honestly felt that they were too good to be left out of the video. So, you know, his heading for me was very overpowered, and I've got to agree with that 87 heading stat. I mean, the 55 defending stat for a striker you're going to be ignoring so you know I'm not really going to comment on that look at that guys if that doesn't show his pace I don't know what does out of nowhere just burst of pace right past the defender just to slam the ball into the back of the net that's the sort of thing he does uh, with ease guys and that 79 passing stat it's okay I mean as a striker slash center forward especially a center forward in the formation that I used you're not going to really be using him for his passing um, but I did use him as a center forward in a 4-2-3-1 formation as well as a cam in a 4-1-2-1-2 formation uh, and he did pick up a couple of assists for me there so let's go through my final thoughts on the legend Patrick Clivert as always will will go through the strengths first shooting honestly feels like 90 anywhere on the pitch that he shot from he challenged the keeper uh, and I gotta say I had a lot of fun just just shooting with him basically guys he's got perfect work rate in high attacking and low defending great pace at 86 very very good dribbling and ball control you will see from some of the goals that I scored just dribbling in and out of the defense and just unleashing the shot I had a lot of fun doing that guys uh, he is amazing in the air and he's pretty much good at everything else now the only weakness as you can see that I found with him is that he felt weak at 
times, even though he's got a very good uh, and reliable strength stat in 82. Uh, he was shrugged off by a lot of people that I expected him to keep the ball from. So that was a bit of a disappointment. But as you can see, I've given him a final score of 9.9 .9 out of 10. Literally the only downside to him is that at times he did feel a bit weak. Uh, and he was shrugged off, off the ball by people uh, that I expected him not to be shrugged off by. Is he worth the coins? I've got to say yes. He is one of the best players in Ultimate Team that I have used so far this year. And he made the game fun to play guys so that's my final thoughts and final review on the legend patrick clivert i hope you enjoyed this video if you did i'd really appreciate you hit that like button it really really does help me out and also hit that subscribe button today if you haven't already and as always take care guys and i will see you all next time ta-ra guys